College of Agriculture and Life Sciences aims to discover, develop, teach, and apply knowledge and technology that enables students, clientele, and citizens of North Carolina and others to improve the quality of their lives and to enhance the agricultural, economic, environmental, and social well-being of the state and world, and to create and extend new knowledge through scientific research and extension in agriculture and in life sciences. Majors offered through the CALS program include Agricultural and Business Management, Agricultural Education, Agricultural and Environmental Technology, Animal Science, Biochemistry, Biological Engineering, Bioprocessing Science, Extension Education, Food Science, Horticultural Science, Natural Resources, Nutrition Science, Plant Biology, Plant and Soil Science, Poultry Science, Soil and Land Development, and Turf Grass Science. Extension Education prepares graduates for positions as agriculture teachers at the secondary and community college level, as well as county extension agents and leaders in the agricultural industry. The Natural Resources majors the application of sound management strategies to make wise use of resources. Careers include forest production, water quality monitoring, or wildlife management. The purpose of the Agricultural Education Program is to prepare graduates for positions as agriculture teachers at the secondary and community college level, as, eight, as county extension agents, and as teachers in the ag agricultural industry. Careers such as these require not only a knowledge of agricultural subject matter, but also the ability to communicate that information effectively to others. Animal science covers traditional production and management of livestock, and also the basic sciences such as reproduction, physiology, genetics, and nutrition. Food science identifies, develops, and applies the appropriate concepts, theories, and emerging methodologies such as chemistry, engineering, microbiology, food processing, nutrition, and sensory science to the investigation of critical issues in food and biological systems. A degree in food science can lead to a career as a food safety inspector, a food technologist, or a flavor chemist. Careers with nutrition science include clinical or private practice as a nutritionist or regist registered dietitian. The Agricultural Business Management Program addresses important issues regarding management of agriculture and related businesses, functioning of agricultural markets, protection and use of natural re resources, and development of government policies affecting agricultural and related industries. Concentrations in this major include Natural Resources Economics and Management and Environmental Sciences Economic Policy. Biochemistry is the science which is concerned with the discovery and understanding of the chemical principles of life. Biochemists graduate with scientific background and skills required for employment in biochemistry, molecular biology, biotechnology, and genetics and for health fields of medicine, veterinary science, pharmacology, and related fields. Genetics is one of the most important fields in the biological sciences because it deals with all aspects of biology such as health and disease, breeding plants and animals for food and fiber, evolution, and the understanding of basic molecular cellular processes. A degree in genetics can lead to a career as a research geneticist, laboratory geneticist, genetic counselor, or clinical geneticist. The plant and soil science major integrates factors associated with improving food, feed, and fiber production and involves application of plant and soil science to produce abundant, high-quality food, feed, and fiber. Careers possible with this major include research scientists, farm producers, soil conservationists, consultants, crop advisors, technical sales representatives. Agricultural science majors study all aspects of the food and fiber industry, develop skills needed to improve yields with less labor, control pests safely and effectively, conserve soil and water, manage or administer research and development programs, and manage marketing or production operations in agribusiness. The biological engineering degree has three concentration areas, environmental, bioprocessing, and agricultural. The program places emphasis on basic science and engineering courses, such as mathematics, physics, chemistry, mechanics, biology, materials, and thermodynamics, providing a solid foundation for application of engineering principles to biological systems. The program is jointly administered by the College of Engineering and the College of Agriculture and Life Sciences. 
Horticulture Sciences uses the tools of modern science to investigate the complex growth and developmental responses of horticulture crops and to develop solutions for problems confronting the horticulture industry. Careers with plant biology include research, teaching, or administration, conservation planning, and environmental monitoring. Soil and land development has two concentrations. The first is land development, which is designed with a focus on the business and financial aspects of the development of land. The second is soil science, which is designed to prepare students to work as soil scientists, either for a consulting company or for a state or federal government. In microbiology, students study basic life processes of viruses, bacteria, and other organisms. Applied areas such as biotechnology, food, and medical microbiology may also be studied. A student with a degree in microbiology can get a job such as a biochemist, biotechnologist, cell biologist, or clinical microbiologist. NC State has the best turf grass science degree in the U.S. It covers the basics of turf grass management. Graduates find careers in golf course and athletic field management, lawn businesses, agribusiness management, and sod production. Careers within poultry science include researchers and managers of large production complexes, corporate executives and bankers, or college deans and faculty. Agricultural and environmental technology is geared to make individuals think ahead using technology responsibly with an eye on the global needs. Research in this program is based in several areas including engineering, bioprocessing, machine systems, and controlled environment agriculture. In zoology, students acquire a knowledge of zoology from the organizational level of molecules and cells to the organizational level of ecosystems. A degree in zoology can lead to careers such as zoo curators, animal and wildlife educators, wildlife rehabilitators, and animal behaviorists. Most college departments require a 2.0 or higher cumulative GPA. Some departments, such as animal science and plant biology, have prerequisite classes. For the segment of the video, we are going to find and interview a random CALS student. Excuse me. Uh. Are you a part of the CALS program here? No. Alright, sorry. <laughs> What areas of fit do you think it would be important to consider for this college? Uh, fit would be, this could be like an interest, ability, work environment, or value. Okay, so um, a lot of the majors that I've noticed or heard about in CALS have to do with like food and agriculture. Uh, so it. kind of an interest in like the, the food supply of the future, food supply of the world, okay. you know, agriculture in general, which is huge in North Carolina. So uh, stuff like that. All right, cool. Yeah. Thank you. Props. All right, thanks. Thank you. There are many scholarship opportunities in the College of Agriculture and Life Sciences. They award approximately $832,000 in scholarships annually. I'm here with Nick Biondo, proud member of the Cowles College here at North Carolina State University. Nick, can you tell me a few things about the student organizations that are offered through the Cowles program? Well, sure. There are a few great clubs and organizations you can join, such as FFA, uh, the Animal Science Club and the one that I'm participating in, the Pre-Vet Club, which is very useful for students wishing to go to the College of Veterinary Medicine after they've completed their undergraduate degree. Can you tell me more about the opportunities for involvement outside of clubs as well as leadership? Well, of course. There's also the State Fair, which is one of the pinnacles of Cal's involvement. We send volunteers there and we also show dairy and beef cattle, among other species of animals, which is a huge part of our fall semester. Now tell me a little bit about the diversity in CALS, and this, this can mean the diversity among the organization, students that are part of these organizations. Mm -hmm. There are many diverse groups of students, of course it's agriculture and life sciences, but that is not limited just to agriculture and animal science, for example. There is also bioscience and engineering within the College of um, Agriculture and Life Sciences, especially in the Life Sciences degree, there's a lot of variety. Um, within it, there's also a very diverse group of people. Of course, you're going to find majority here or there, but we're very, very diverse in our interests and our field of study. Thank you, Nick. Of course. Many Cal students participate in internships and co-op opportunities throughout the year. 
Internships can be found in all Cal's majors. They can range from small local businesses to large corporate companies such as Monsanto. Cal students can expect to work in a variety of conditions. These can range from laboratories to hospitals to classrooms and even field work.